Which quotation from To You most effectively illustrates the claim? To You is an 1856 poem by Walt Whitman. In the poem, Whitman suggests that he deeply understands the reader whom he addresses directly, writing blank. So the claim here is that Whitman under deeply understands the reader and that he addresses them directly. So choice A says, your true soul and body appear before me. This seems to be correct because here it shows that he directly addresses the reader by saying your, and it shows that he also deeply understands the reader by saying that he, he sees his true soul and body appear before him. So A seems to be the correct answer. B. Whoever you are, now I place my hand upon you, that you be my poem. This is incorrect because while it does address the reader directly, it doesn't show that he deeply understands the reader. So B is incorrect. C. I should have made my way straight to you long ago. This is incorrect for the same reason as B, because although it does direct, directly address the reader, it doesn't imply, it doesn't show that he deeply understands the reader. D. Whoever you are, I fear you are walking the walks of dreams. This is incorrect because although it does directly address the reader and it uh, just expresses a concern for the reader, its concern doesn't show that he deeply understands the reader. It's just mere concern for the reader. So the correct answer is A.